there's something about the Gateron cream soda that I'm heavily drawn to, and I can't quite put my finger on it. Whether it's the clacky long pull nature of the switch, or the fact that one of my favorite Franken switches now has a representable alternative. Some quick specs, the Gateron cream sodas are a linear switch with a milky top, ink bottom, a 13.2mm long pull palm stem, 18mm 63g spring, and comes lightly lubed from the factory. The estimated cost is anywhere from 70 to 75 cents a switch, which puts it just in line with the black ink V2s. Backstory time, early on in my Franken switching journey, I came across this one Gateron Franken switch you've probably heard of before, the Cthulhu, which, as you guessed, is an ink bottom, milky top, and at that point a cream stem. And I absolutely fell in love with the sound and the feel of these switches, to the point where I was dailying them, as they were the right combination between a long pull feel and a deep, clacky sound profile. And when the group I ends, we have the cream sodas, an all-in-one and more affordable alternative. Punctu's inspiration behind these switches was to combine popular materials and features that are commonly found in other switches into an all-in-one package. And while we can make the case that most switches on the market nowadays falls into this philosophy, it's still nice to see new variations, even from older manufacturers like Gateron. Taking these out of the box and trying them for the first time, I'm honestly impressed by how smooth they are, even to the point where my own Cthulhus don't even compare. Granted, they have a Kingfisher stem that's probably not doing any justice, but the point remains. If you're thinking CJ level smooth, you're right on the money. The factory lubing is light enough, and I didn't notice any spring or leaf ping either. While there is a little bit of top housing wobble, films are recommended, but not necessary. I will say these springs are a bit heavy for my taste, but your mileage may vary, and overall, I think it's a pretty pleasing sound profile. It's nice to see innovations within the switch space, to the point where switches are being dummy smooth out of the box with amazing factory lubing and machining, to offering new materials and sound profiles to truly make your board your own. As for me, I still enjoy the journey of making Franken switches for random parts, but the cream sodas do strike a nostalgic chord for me back to a time when I thought brass plates were endgame. But that's all I got for you guys, I'm a little sad to have to send these back, but if you want to learn more about these switches and other updates, you can check the Geek Hack linked below. Thanks, and have a good one. Bye.